Remember. Remember. The 5th of November. The gunpowder, treason and plot. I know of no reason why the gunpowder treason should ever be forgot. I stand before you today not just as anonymous, but as a human being. Together, we stand here now, as we stood in February, and as we stood in March. We stand here to break the wall of silence between members of the Church of Scientology and their families outside. We stand here, because there are those who cannot. Those who fear fair game. Those who have been intimidated and silenced. Those who have been framed, arrested, and imprisoned. Those who fear for their lives and their families. Disconnection is a simple policy within the Church of Scientology. If a Scientologist has a friend or family member who is not supportive of the Church, then the Scientologist is encouraged to handle them, and if they cannot, or will not, be handled the Scientologist is forced to disconnect from them. This destroys families. Imagine not speaking a word to your daughter or son, your sister or brother, your mother or father, not for days and weeks, but for years and decades on end. Imagine not even receiving a Christmas card from someone dear to your heart, because they are forbidden to contact you. We stand for those trapped within the church. We stand for their fathers and mothers, brothers and sisters, husbands and wives, sons and daughters outside the church. We stand for those who wonder to this day how their loved ones are doing. We stood in the past, we stand now, and we will continue to stand, until the wall of silence is rubble, and those families, torn apart for so long, can finally come back together as one. And our last message is from all of Anonymous, to those still inside the church. Do not fear to break your chains, for, when you leave your prison of darkness and return to the light, we will be there to help you. Many have gone before you, and they will help you truly escape your prison. The Church of Scientology is no longer regarded as a church but rather a cult. The Church of Scientology is no longer regarded as a charitable trust but rather an organization that scams its members. There is always the free zone. For as long as it takes, we will stand. We are anonymous. We are the voice of the voiceless. We are the face of the faceless. We are the will of the powerless and the strength of the weak, banded together under a common cause. You are all welcome to support Anonymous, to support disconnected families, to support the truth. Whatever your background, whatever your religion, whatever your race and beliefs, if you believe families should stand as one, you are welcome. On April 12 Anonymous will march again. This April 12, Anonymous will take to the streets once more in peaceful protests against the Church of Scientology and its disconnection policy. Meeting locations in New Zealand are as follows. Auckland meeting by Brittemert at 11 a.m. You will see us. Wellington. 11 a.m. on the corner of Manors and Q the malls outside Burger King. Christ Church. Meet in the square at 11 to 11.30 a.m. We are Anonymous. We are Legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. We will be heard. We now stand as one. Expect us.